Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Red Wolf TV. I'm Tim and today I'll be taking you through one of the ICS products. This one stuck out like a sore thumb as its real steel counterpart was the only one, out of all of them, that took part in World War II. Here we have the very iconic M1 Garand AEG. I'm sure you're not here for a history lesson, so let me go into greater detail. It looks, feels, and smells, and even tastes like real wood, because it is, and everything in black is made out of metal. It weighs a little over 3.7 kilograms, which is just under 8.3 pounds. In length, it's about 111 centimeters, which is just under 44 inches. Underneath, it has two sling mounts and one stack mount, which you can find at the front. It's got very realistic front and adjustable rear sights, the left for distance and the right knob for windage. The battery is stored in the buttstock and you could use anything with a small Tamiya adapter. The safety can be found right in front of a trigger, back for safety and forward to fire. The differences between this AEG and what you're used to seeing is instead of using a stripper clip of which you insert from above, it has now been replaced by a magazine of which you insert from underneath, which is not very realistic, but interesting as it was the only way to get around the gearbox. You release the magazine by pressing the bolt release. One of the coolest and most realistic functions of the M1 Garand AG is when you pull the bolt latch back, how everything moves. And when you do open it, it reveals the adjustable hop up. And when you let go, it sounds utterly amazing. This comes with two magazines holding 45 BBs each. I'll be using 0.2 grams, six millimeter BBs. I feel something's missing. Ah, oh, there it is. One thing you were looking for at the end was that iconic ping sound when you empty the magazine. Unfortunately, this does not give it to you. It is an AEG, so you could run it the entire skirmish. And without that ping sound, you won't be giving away your position. But without the ping sound, would this be an ideal M1 Garand replica? And one thing I'd also like to mention is that I am now on Facebook, so you can add Red Wolf Tim to your friends list and we can talk shop. So for this cool product and many more, go to our website at www.redwolfairsoft.com. There is plenty more where that came from, and if you have missed out some of our previous videos, be sure to check out one of these. Do subscribe to our channel and keep up to date with our newest and coolest videos.